Hello everybody, this is Tony Martinez with Lazy Days RV in the Villages Wildwood. Uh, today I had a special request. I'm dealing with some folks that are in another state. They wanted a kind of more in-depth video than I usually do on a pre-owned unit that we have here. So today we are looking at the Phantom, Nexus Phantom. Okay, this particular unit is a 2017. And it is stock number 12004609. And this can be viewed on our website, lazydays.com. Uh, it's a very nice motorhome. Um, I'm going to go around it. I'll show you everything that's wonderful and then anything that's not, uh, which there are some things I do want to point out. Uh, as far as the exterior goes, I didn't find anything remarkable in a negative way. It looks pretty good. It is pre-owned, so you are going to have a little weather checking and things like the the decals. But, you know, that is to be expected. Um, awning looks good. It's a little bit windy today. But I've got her out, and she looks good. And I did notice that it has a very nice outdoor entertainment center here which I'll show you here real quick. Okay. Let's make our way inside. I've got it plugged in, lights on, AC going. It feels nice in here, which is good because it's 91 degrees here today. We're at the end of May. All right, so let's start here in the front. Uh, I didn't mention it before, but this has 25,000, just over 25,000 miles on it cranks right up uh, drove good it does have auto leveling jacks now what I want to show you is this everything in here with the artificial leather is peeling like crazy and it needs redone there's just it's 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 just coming off and you need to be aware of that because we're not fixing it so we'll make you a good opportunity on it but you need to be aware that that is there this side is worse because it's I think was used more um, and that's just a unfortunate thing you know that happens to a lot of RVs uh, especially between 2014 and 2019 and this is right there 2017 um, up top here you've got your your bunk area and you do have a good size TV um, I did look underneath here because on class C's, you know, if you're going to have an issue in the front, it's usually here. It looks nice and dry. I didn't see anything in a negative way. Um, and I looked on this side as well. Best I could. Okay. I didn't see anything negative. Uh, booth dinette does turn into a bed. Again, the same product. It's coming off. All right. Um... On this side, you do have a jackknife style sofa. Out of everything, this one seems to be holding up the best, but it's still, it still has the issue. Okay, moving on. Oh, I didn't mention, but you do have opposing slides. So this side is a slide room, and this side is a slide room. This side over here is a driver's side. All right, you've got your stove, your oven, Looks like somebody added that aftermarket. There you go, nice and clean. And overall, this thing looks good, smells good. I didn't detect any type of smoke, any pets. There's your microwave, and let's see, that is, I only see microwave option. I don't see that it is a convection as well. So microwave oven. Here's your sink area. Uh, and while I'm thinking about it, I did stomp around this entire unit. The floor is nice and sturdy. I didn't feel any soft spots. Okay. Refrigerator. It's going to be electric and or propane. Nice big pantry. Alright. Coming into this area, we're going to be in the bathroom. And then you've got your shower opposite with sunshine coming in. Got a 
of the nice skylight. Okay, now this is going to be the bedroom area here, and I'll back up so we can get a better view. But you do have a TV, large closets. This is a queen size bed. That's your third slide room there. And this is equipped with two air conditioners. Coleman Mach. Now, let me flip around so I can show you something. But before I do, I wanted to point out that I came to the very back here and I noticed something a little unique that I wasn't, I'm not accustomed to and I don't sell these new. So it may be something they do, but it's, it seems to be a little dovetailed here on the end or, or beaver tailed whatever you want to call it it's got a little slant now i stomped all around on here to make sure it wasn't some weird repair and it's very solid it's just not something that i was accustomed to so at this point back it's it slants a bit so again it feels great it's nothing i would personally be concerned about but i wanted you to know it was there because i know you're going to be traveling to get here all right there's the closets. Let me open one of them for you. These are going to be both the same size. Very nice. I mean, be very comfortable in this. A lot of drawers. Okay. So again, my name is Tony Martinez. I work for Lazy Days RV in the Villages. You can reach me directly on my cell phone at 352-602-6282. If you have any other questions, feel free to contact me. Thanks a lot.